Welcome to our video on troubleshooting Python's Pandas Data Reader. Today, we're addressing a frustrating issue that many developers encounter. Our viewer recently tried to grab stock data from Yahoo Finance using Pandas Data Reader, and while it worked just hours before, it's now throwing errors. Let's dive into the details and see how we can help resolve this problem. All right, guys, we're back with another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find your solution that you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. Today, we're troubleshooting an issue with Python's Pandas Data Reader. Specifically, we're unable to fetch stock data from Yahoo Finance, even though it worked just hours ago. First, let's ensure that we have the latest version of Pandas Data Reader. You can upgrade it using the command pip install pandas data reader jash upgrade. After upgrading, we import the package as usual. Here's how you can do that. From pandas data reader, import data wb. Now let's check the code for fetching stock data from Yahoo. We use the data reader function with the parameters for Apple stock. If you encounter a remote data error, it indicates that the URL for Yahoo Finance is no longer accessible. This is a common issue due to changes in Yahoo's API. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. It seems that the data reader isn't working because the website is currently down. This isn't an error on your end as others have experienced the same issue. To confirm the issue, you can check the error message. A good next step is to visit the URL directly, which is currently unavailable. And that's it, guys. I hope the video has helped find you to that resolution and you're able to get through your problem. If you did, guys, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. It does help me out. And until next time, have a good one.